Well, good day, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of the Elban Rhino Beer Review. This will probably be one of the very last videos ever done on the tablet. I'll probably start doing everything on the uh, cell phone again because one, I have the cell phone stand, so I don't have to sit here and try and hold this, and two, <laughs> it just uh, isn't as zoomed in as this piece of shit. Anyway, today we're looking at from Niagara College, their small cr batch brew, which used to be certified originals. This is their Channing's APA, which is 4.5% alcohol by volume. So let's grab our opener. Let's uh, pop this little baby. Yeah, I know. Oh my god, look at how hairy his hands are. It's a good thing I came out albino because if I was a redhead like the rest of my family, Bad things, guys. Bad things. Alrighty. Well, that's a very pretty beer. Wow. Beautiful brown color. Off white head, big bubbles. We'll drink our sorrows away. That's right, drink our sorrows away. Smell? Hmm. A little bit of citrus. I'm talking like uh, not orange or anything, but like grapefruit, lemon, lime type of citrus. A little bit of citrus and a little bit of uh, of like caramel and blackstrap molasses almost. Let's try the beer. Cheers. Let's move this stuff over here. You don't have to look at the red racer stuff. Nobody wants to look at the red racer. What is that? What is that on the table? That's paper, but what is it's a string of some type? Mmm. Okay. Um, I just did the Maritimer Marzen, and either this is the same student or they're using the same yeast or, or something, because this is close to the same. Yeah, it has a lot more hop bite to it than the uh, Maritimer Marzen, but it's very bready, it's very biscuity, it's very, uh, very dry. Your hop profile, getting some citrus, getting some, uh, getting some pine, and getting a lot of dirtiness, a lot of Very light, very easy to drink. It is 4.5% alcohol, so you could drink a couple bombers of this if you really wanted to. And there's nothing wrong with drinking a couple bombers of this because there's nothing wrong with this beer. <clears throat> is it a really good APA? No, it's probably a very, uh, very good introduct introduction to the style. It is a little more roasty than most APAs I've had. And a little more bready, biscuity, and dry than most APAs I've had. But, um... 
Other than that, you do get that nice citrus, you do get that nice woodiness, and uh, those are the hop profiles that you would normally get in an APA, so it is a good introductory, because it's not that bitter, it's not that in your face, it is just subtle. <laughs> oh, burp's nice. Out of 10 on this, I would give it another 7. Thank you guys for watching. Or, I'll be until I'm sorry for the shakiness. Bye-bye.